The Crusaders have held their opponents to under 39 times throughout its first 13 games, and more recently they'd hold their last two to under 20. And once again, the defense would shine for Notre Dame, starting the contest, forcing back-to-back -back turnovers on the home team. Crusaders going up 11-0 on the Spartans. Julia Pohl with the tray to cap off the scoring run. Spartans held to just four through the opening eight minutes. The score 13-4 after one. Southern Lehigh got to making things interesting. The freshman Gabriella Netwall on the little reverse layup. Spartans start the second on a 6-1 run to make it just a four-point game with 2.16 to play before the break. Crusaders hit two clutch shots in the final two minutes, though, as they will take a 19-12 advantage into halftime. Spartans trying to stay in this one. The nice feed from Reese McIntosh to Lila Patton off the glass for two. She'll keep it at an eight-point deficit. They'll cut it to six, but then the visitors use an eight-nothing run to end the third to go in front 32-18 after three. Notre Dame will push the lead to his largest 20 in this one. Just too much offense to handle for the Spartans as they'll fall in this one by a 45-27 final score. We've been preparing all week for this game, and we knew that Southern Lehigh was going to be pretty hype and ready. And, I mean, we've just been working hard. we got to give our 100% at practice all the time and we got to come in with positive energy and a good attitude. We're talking about practice. At least that's the case for the Crusaders who feel like their efforts in between contests have allowed them to get back on the right track, now winning three straight since their loss to Central Catholic. We've just been really focused at practice. You know, last week we only had a Thursday game and this week we only have a Thursday game. So that's like three days of practice going into games. So like we're getting up and down the floor at practice and then like we're doing like team specific stuff the day before getting ready like for our opponents. Our kids were down about the loss we knew we didn't play our best our best basketball that day and um, this team's been really really focused at practice and, and that's just not varsity it, it extends to our JV team we, we practice together and we challenge the entire group all 25 of them to you know hey if we want to really progress as a program we all have to you know do our part and uh, and I, I I've been so impressed with the way all 25 of them have really responded at Southern Lehigh I'm Cassie Schmidt reporting for the SC Network